All right, now often when you start animating on your projects, uh, it happens that there will be a lot of animation um, on your timeline, as in this scene right here. Lots of characters are moving, lots of other animations are going on. And so all of your characters uh, and any other uh, objects that you animate will have uh, animation and they will have keyframes. So what if you want to um, remove a bunch of maybe all of the animation? Um, what you could do is go through all of the layers and just remove it all um, just by going through all the layers. But there is a, very, um, a, a quicker way to do it. Um, let's say you want to remove all of the animation. Um, what you do, you go on... Um, uh, let's say if you want to remove all of it, you go on um, <clears throat> the group layer uh, uh, where all the, all the layers are in, and I recommend that you do that um, because that way you uh, you have more control of it, um, but you can also select them all at the same time. But anyway, um, if you select the group layer, and you go to animation, you go to clear animation, and then when you go to clear animation, you see these tabs right here. Um, <clears throat> and if we want to remove all of it, you can click on clear animation from document. And what happens is all the animation will be removed. So that's a very quick way to get rid of all of it. But however, let's say you want to remove just uh, just a few things, not all of it. So if I will undo this, it goes back to normal again. Um, let's say we want to um, <clears throat> remove the animation for only this character. Um, well, of course, um, we can just remove this, but let's say he would have um, animation inside of his other, uh, his inside layers. Um, how are you going to do that? Well. Again, you uh, make sure you select the layer that you want the animation to be removed from. Um, and then you go to animation again, clear animation, and then from layer. Um, and then you get uh, this uh, tab right here, which is, do you want to clear the sub layers too? Um, and in this case, it is yes, because um, that uh, basically it's talking about the layers inside of the bone layer and it means that you also remove the animation from those layers. So that way you can see this character is not um, animated again at all. So that's, uh, that's how you do it with layers. So there's uh, finally there's um, another option if I undo it again. Um, what if you just want to remove <clears throat> everything after um, frame 24, let's say like this. Um, what you can do is um, go to the group layer and again, click on animation, clear animation and click on clear animation from document after current frame. And if you click that, um, what happens is anything that is in front of frame 24 is still there, but anything after frame 24 is gone. <clears throat> so if I undo it, um, that is also a way to uh, remove animation, um, certain animation. <clears throat> you can do the same thing uh, with animation in front of a frame. So um, you click on, you go to clear animation, and you have a whole a bunch of options. So in the case of a layer, as we just show with the cowboy layer, you can also do it, uh, remove the animation from after the current frame or before, um, or just the layer at the current frame. So just only the animation that is on that frame. And same thing with uh, the entire document. Uh, so that way, um, <clears throat> it uh, saves you a lot of time if you want to remove a lot of animation because otherwise uh, like I had uh, to do in the past I had to remove all of it uh, by going through all these layers and that's uh, pretty much work but yeah 
So I hope this is useful for you. Um, and yeah, that's about it. If you have any more questions, uh, leave comments and thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe for more. I make new tutorials every week on Wednesday. I also make my own animations. I will upload them whenever they are ready so you can watch those as well. Thanks for watching guys.